In the heart of San Francisco, a community effort is transforming gravel into edible gold. Neighborhood activists are converting a broken down freeway ramp into an urban farm. This used to be the off ramp and this was the on ramp. The garden is located in the Hayes Valley District and has been open since this year January. The city came to myself and a partner to actually get um, a plan together to activate the space. We created these proposals called the Hayes Valley Farm Project and decided that uh, we would use urban agriculture as a strategy to build community, activate the space. The general agricultural plan here is, is successionary planting. And so we brought in these wood chips and this horse manure and the cardboard and we combined it together in what we call lasagna gardening or, or sheet mulching. And that's kind of the base layer of the soil. The environment is challenging and forces the gardeners to come up with creative solutions. The on-ramp still had asphalt on it. So we were thinking, what's our, the best alternative, the freeway food forest? It originally just consisted of the idea of bringing fruit trees into the site and literally planting them right on top of the asphalt, just identified as probably the biggest patio you'll find <laughs> in all of San Francisco. Urban gardening is based on the work of volunteers who meet up for bi-weekly work parties. Um, I think living in an urban environment, um, I don't have a backyard, have a little balcony, and um, just kind of like I think we have like an inherent desire to kind of garden or connect with the earth at some level. We encourage a lot of the volunteers to come and plant seeds and cultivate them and harvest. What's important about growing your own food is that you know where it comes from. You can actually make a choice um, to use the healthiest methods, both for the planet and for you. I'd like to invite everyone just to come. This place is magical. Uh, it's an amazing place to be. It's an amazing place to meet people, to grow some food, to have a lot of fun. Jana Sinchnik, K Art News, San Francisco.